Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be doing a what's in my bag for you guys. I did already do a bag reveal on this bag, so I just want to show you guys what I have in here. But before we get started, I also have some friend mail that I want to share with you guys. So if you're new here, guys, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Make sure to like this video and leave a comment down below. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for subscribing and tuning back in with me today. All right, guys, so before we jump into this with some of my bag, I do have um, some, I have friend mail and I also have an order from Victoria's Secret that came in today. So I'm gonna start with my friend mail that I got from the Novel Crown. She is a YouTuber on here. And I will leave a link to her channel down below, guys, so you guys can go check her out. She has some amazing content, so make sure that after you finish watching this video, you go subscribe to her channel and watch some of her videos. Alright, so we're going to get into this unboxing. Um, I believe she sent me something of like a pouch or something from Victoria's Secret because she watched my um, um, my unbagging of my Victoria's Signature Tote, the Iconic Signature Tote, and I was saying that I didn't have any pieces to go with that particular bag. So she uh, inboxed me on IG and told me that she was going to send me something. So let's get right on into it. Alright guys, so that's how it came. Super cute. I'm so excited. Oh, so she sent me a cute little note too that just says, hope you can use this. Enjoy the novel crown. Thank you. I truly, truly, truly appreciate it. So let's get into this. And that's what the back of the note looks like. Oh, and she sent me some goodies too. They look like they may be mint or chocolate. I'm not sure which one. Hmm. All right. So I'll be getting into that later. <laughs> or they may not be either one. They may be the some wipes. I'm not sure. Alright, so this is what the pouch looks like. Super cute. That's the bottom. It does have two functional pockets here on the outside. And I absolutely love that. We'll definitely be utilizing this when I carry this in my um, Victoria's Secret tote. Oh, she even got something on the inside for me. Oh. Thank you. So that is what the inside looks like. It's just the black signature print Victoria usually has in their pouch with the um, stripes in the inside and this does have the wipeable material. So that's what the inside looks like. And it does have two additional smaller pockets. Hopefully you guys can see that. So one is here and the other one is right here. Okay. And that's that mesh material as well too. The pockets are the mesh material. So let's see what this is. It looks like it might be another little pouch. From Victoria's Secret. Y'all, this is so cute. So this looks like the Kiss Lock from Victoria's Secret, the little coin pouch. And I actually was looking at this. Um, I wasn't sure like how fuzzy or fluffy it was, but this is adorable, y'all. Look at that. And it does come with the o-ring as well too so you can attach your keys or attach it to your handbag if you like and then that's just what the inside looks like it's that black 
scrape signature print in the inside okay so this is absolutely gorgeous thank you the novel queen i cannot wait to use this inside of my victoria's secret iconic scribe tote but i'll also probably be using this in some of my other pink bags as well too so thank you thank you thank you and don't forget guys to go check out her channel when you're done watching this one all right so the next thing i got was an order from victoria's secret i did order something that i saw on whose channel was i watching y'all because i can't even i'm not even gonna lie i was watching so many of you guys channel but i believe it was miss toya's channel and also um asha baby o channel um, and they both have this pouch and I believe this is, what are they calling this? I think they're calling it their rollerball perfume case. So this is what it looks like. And y'all, let me tell y'all, I had to go on a hunt for this because originally when I ordered this off of the site, well, when I first went on the site, they didn't have it. You have to actually know the name of this and then type it in for it to even pop up on the Victoria's Secret website. Excuse me. Then when I finally figured out what the name was because I went on Poshmark and Macari and a few people had, I guess, what, the, what they're calling it. So... I typed it in on Victoria's Secret. It popped up. It said that they had it in one of my local stores, so I opt to do the pickup so I could just go pick it up the next day. Well, I waited about two days, went to go pick it up, and when I get to the store, they tell me, oh, well, we it shows that we only have one, but your name is not the one listed under the person supposed, supposed to be getting it. She was like, and we don't sell this in store or whatever, so you'll have to order it off of the website. So this was running on clearance for $9.99 on the website. So of course, when I ordered it, it was like almost another $10 for shipping. So altogether, I paid about $20. I think I paid like $18 for this. So I was kind of mad that I had to pay an extra almost $10 to get this. But when I saw it, I really wanted it. So I just went ahead and ordered it. So this is just what it looks like. It does have the O-ring at the top so you can attach it to your bag. If you would like, it also has the Victoria's Secret charm on the front as well, too. And then on the zipper, if I can get this off really quickly. Um, so this is what the zipper looks like. It just has that pink leather tab on it. And then you just unzip it like so. And let me take the stuffing out. And that's what it looks like in the inside, okay? So you can put lipstick in here, your lip balms. You can also put your roller balls, hand sanitizer. You can pretty much put whatever you want in this. I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to use this, but I did know that I wanted it, and I'm glad that I was able to get it. Okay, so... Let's just jump into this what's in my bag. So here is an overview of the bag. So that's what the inside looks like. And like I said, I already have a bag reveal on this bag. So we're just going to jump right into this. So in the front pocket here. So here in the front pocket, I just have my strawberry cheesecake body mist. I also have the strawberry cheesecake lotion to go with it. And I got both of those from Walmart. The Lysol to go spray. And if you guys didn't know, this is the new look of the Lysol to go spray. It is bigger and wider than the ones before. So just FYI, this may not be able to fit in your smaller bags like the other ones could, but I do like to try to have this on hand when it will fit inside my bag. And then in the little small compartment right here, 
So the little small compartment right here, I just have my Barbie Revlon X tweezers, okay? And that is all that I have in the front pocket right here. So on the side, I just have my um, pink and white pom-pom, and then I also have my Bath and Body Works pocket pack in the s'mores, and in the inside, I have Twisted Peppermint as my hand sanitizer. So on this back pocket right here, I have my tech stuff in here. So I have my pink phone stand that I got in friend mail from Miss T. I have my wall adapter plug. I have my cord, my cell phone cord. My pocket knife, my Barbie Revlon X manicure set in here. I have an extra pair of headphones and one of my power banks. And that is all that's in that back pocket. Okay, so we're just going to put all of that back. And we're gonna snap that closed. All right, and we're gonna turn this back around to the front. And on the top is my wallet. This is my Jessica Simpson wallet. I love this wallet. I love the shape of this wallet. I think it is absolutely adorable. So I have that in there. I love the gold studs on it as well too. It does have a top zipper and I just like the way that it opens up. So it opens like this. You have your middle compartment here where you can put your coins and then you also have your money fold compartment here which I do have some cash in there. So that is that. Attached to my key fob here, I just have my mini mouse Samsung um, earbuds in here. So I have that in there. And I'm not going to take this off. I'm just going to leave it hanging on the outside of the bag. So the next thing that I have in here is my snack pouch. And as you guys can see, I need to re-up on my snack pouch. But in here, I just have my nature valley sweet and salty this is the dark chocolate peanuts and almonds and then some extra gum and polar ice so i have that in there and i'm just going to reach back in this slip pocket back here and i just have my business cards and my dollar 25 flashlight in the zipper compartment, in the back, I just have my checkbook back there. So that's all that I have in that pocket. And then in the front pockets here, in the front, I'll flip this over so you guys can see it, but in the front compartments right here, I just have a pink mask, a clean pink mask. And then I have some paperwork. And I also have the iWalk um, portable charger. I first saw this on just one Etsy, so I decided to order this. So I have that in here. And I know I showed this before, but I'll show it again if you're new here. You just press the little button on the side right here. And then it shows you the percentage of the portable charger and you just pop the little top off right here and depending on whether you have a C port or a iPhone will be what that will be right there so really cute got this off of Amazon Oops. Uh oh, just drop my portable charger so I also have my pen in here and I got this in friend mail from Miss T, and this is just the Minnie Mouse pen in silver. So I have that in the back pocket as well, too. And I'm going to try to put these stuff back in the pockets that they came out of. I also have an orange highlighter. I also have a red pen. 
my scissors, and the last thing in that pocket is my big mini whiteout. All right. So, the next thing in here is my Steve Madden pouch. And this is the one that has the double zip. And of course, this is the front. So on the top part, I just have my first aid kit right here. And I just added some Minnie Mouse stickers to that. And in here, I just have some Neosporin. I have some aspirin, non-aspirin, alcohol, wipes, and gauze, and band-aids. That's what I have in here. And then I just have my Q-tips. And that is all that I have in that front compartment. So let's close that back up. And then in the back zipper compartment right here, I just have some disposable glo um, pink gloves. I have some Clorox wipes. I have my contacts, extra pair of contacts, the contact case, my placards, and my contact solution. And that is all that I have in that compartment. next pouch that I have in here is my Ruby and Cash pouch and it just says lipstick is the answer and in here I have my raspberry whipped vanilla this is my room spray so I use this like for when I go to the bathroom if it doesn't smell so fresh my unmentionables I also have some Neutrogena makeup remover wipes and I don't wear makeup guys but I like having these because I do wear my mask at work and I get really oily in my t-zone so I like using this to wipe my face and then I have the disposable no water needed toothbrushes I have some panty liners I have some wet ones and I also have some Summer's Eve and this is in the Share Floral. And I also have my travel size toilet tissue. You never know when you go in these public bathrooms and they don't have toilet tissue or soap, guys. So I also have my um, soap packet that I got from Miss T and Friend Mail, okay? So, if you can get your hands on those guys, definitely pick some of those up uh, uh, along with the toilet tissue because they do come in handy. Like I said, when you're out and about, somebody may have forgot to put tissue, restock the bathroom with tissue, you know, they could have not restock the soap dispenser so it is good to have those things on hand in your um, pocketbook because you do not want to get caught going to the bathroom and not having no toilet tissue or any soap to wash your hands so the next pouch that i have in here is my clear pouch that i got from i believe i got this from walmart this is a clearest pouch and I got this from Walmart and in the inside is some Ricola in this small zipper compartment. I just have some Ricola in there. So that's what's in there. My Ricola cough drops. And then in the top zipper compartment, I have my tissue packet and it's tissue packet cover and then the inside I just have some mini mouse tissue and I have some tea in here as well too these are just tea packets that I like to keep on hand just in case and then my pill case and in here I just have 
The black pill is charcoal pills, Tylenol. Um, why can't I think of what this is? Um, this is the cold medicine, NyQuil, day and NyQuil cold medicine. And then down here at the bottom, the pink pills are allergy pills. So they're the Benadryl allergy pills. And let me know down below in the comments, guys, if Benadryl makes you really sleepy or groggy. I know if I take one, I'm usually okay. I do still get sleepy, but if I take two, y'all, I am no good to nobody. And that's for at least a day, like real talk. So I try not to take the Benadryl unless I absolutely need to. The next pouch is this really cute pink pouch that I got in friend mail from Mom Ambition when I won her giveaway, 500 subscriber giveaway. So, so glad that I'm able to put this to use. And I have my Revlon lipstick in here. This is in Black Cherry. I also have my Bath and Body Works lip shine in here. This is in the vanilla mint supreme and i really like this and i love it does have a taste to it and i do like the taste to it so i know that's weird but whatever <laughs> and then i also have my compact mirror as well too that i got from ross and that is all that i have in that pouch all right That's it back up and I believe that is everything guys so that is all that I had in this bag as you can see it is empty except for what was in those side pockets so yeah that is everything that I had in my bag so I hope you guys had a wonderful holiday. I know I did. I know MLK Day is coming up. So you guys, please make sure if you're going to be out and about celebrating, make sure that you guys be safe. And I will see you guys in my next video. So if you guys give me a sec, I will set up to show you all what all I had in my bag. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.